Hey guys, welcome to KK Java Tutorials. Uh, in previous video tutorial, we have seen how we can break the singleton using reflection. So we have seen uh, various various approaches to implement singleton design pattern in Java. And drawback is that in every approach we can break singleton using reflection. What we have seen. If you have if you did not watch previous video tutorial, then I recommend you to go and watch uh, previous video tutorial. Then come to watch this video. Yeah. So now thing is that if singleton can be uh, broken by reflection then what is the resolution how we can overcome this situation so answer is enum using enum easily you can uh, implement uh, singleton right so here i have created uh, let me show you previously i have created uh, this program and here uh, here is the singleton class and here is the client program which basically breaks singleton so here singleton one and singleton two which i have created using reflection and if you see uh, these two uh, uh, instances having different hash code means singleton uh, can broke your sing uh, uh, sorry reflection can bro break your singleton here yeah? now uh, let's move ahead and try to create a singleton using enum yeah so i have created a project with name singleton using enum and here i have a client program with blank uh, nothing there is no code snippet and here is the package with dot singleton so here i am going to create a singleton so right click over here go to the new and here choose enum and you can give any name to your singleton class right so i have given just singleton right and uh, you know using uh you know uh, it's really really very easy to create a singleton so simply you need to declare uh your uh, basically singleton instance like you can give the any name i am going to give get instance that's it and this is your singleton here putting semicolon uh, is uh, basically not mandatory it's optional so this is your singleton let's say i'm going to uh, create a method inside this uh, class itself which returns a string and method name is let's say welcome and this method is going to return simply a string i would say single turn that's it simply i have uh, just i'm returning a single turn string from this uh, uh, basically method yeah uh, now in test program how we can get this singleton instance you, using this class yeah, i mean enum or uh, name you can get this singleton from anywhere in our application right we get something like this yeah let's say this is singleton one yeah we can create instance of this singleton any number of times and make sure that every time it returns a uh, same has code so i'm going to check has code of instance one and has code of instance two and let's see if both are same or not if not same then sing this is not singleton if both are same that will uh this is returning a single instance in entire JVM. here you can see both singleton one and singleton two are having the same has code yeah now you get the uh, basically singleton instance using this instance you can call any method like we have a welcome method right you can call this method and this return message you can print it easily over here right if i run this application this guy is going to return a message gets printed right and both uh singleton one and singleton two is having the same high school yeah so earlier we have seen uh, there was a drawback on every approaches in every every approaches you can break the single using reflection and to overcome overcome that situation we uh, we use a ref uh, basically enum to implement a singleton design pattern java ensures that any enum value is instantiated only once uh, in java program since java enum values are globally accessible so so that this is singleton singleton will work perfectly fine okay the drawback is that enum type is somewhat inflexible for example it does not allow lazy initialization so when you create singleton using enum then this will always 
instantiate singleton uh, in uh, eager logic eager loading manner that's not possible to basically instantiate uh, in a uh, in lazy loading fashion okay so that's all i have in this video tutorial guys so it's a, there was really this was really a quick video on how to create a singleton using uh, uh, enum so i hope you understood uh, as far as source code concerned i will upload source code on uh, my blog kkjavatarians.com and i will provide a source link in the video description part itself if you really like this video then hit on the like button didn't subscribe kk java tutorial series then please go ahead and subscribe it guys big thank you for watching this video and see you there in the next video tutorial